<laughs> for Bond with tellers and uses almost all of the things that you brought up. How often do you change the windows? Well, we change the windows once a week. We have 28 windows in New York that we change once a week. And what about indoors? Do you change anything indoors, too? Indoors. Uh, each floor has a day that it gets trimmed, yes. Well, you know, your windows in Bond with tellers are not only extraordinary, but they're one of the things that makes Fifth Avenue so glamorous. Now, you've done some decorations for the White House also, I understand. Yes. I, uh, when Jackie Onassis was down there, I worked on some of the parties and uh, did the Christmas decorations in the White House the years that LBJ was there and also the uh, altar for Linda Bird's uh, wedding. What would you say are the qualifications for your job? What does a man have to have to do that? Well, it's very important to be able to use your hands and to have uh, a sense of what looks well, a sense of taste and um, uh, dexterity, I would say. Well, apparently you have that in a very high degree because you've been named the Display Man of the Year by the International Display Organization. And that's quite an extraordinary achievement, I think. So, panel, we thought we'd like to test your window dressing quotient right here on stage. Lloyd, could we have the curtain open, please? All right, now we're going to have two teams. Soupy and Donna on this side, and Gene and Melba on this side. Your job now is to dress uh, these two You better two pull men. yourself together, buddy. Okay. You dress these two mannequins, okay. and whoever gets it done the first and the bestest wins the prize. And neatness counts. Are, are you we, ready? Listen, yes. why, why can't, why can't can they I have stop? their hands on it, You can please. put the hands on when Got you get all finished, because it'll make it easier for oh, you. Oh, I see. Let them start with the yeah, undershirt. Ready, set, okay. go. Oh, oh, you know how to do that. Okay. I don't wear a shirt. You better put the arms up if you want to put an undershirt on, ladies. <laughs> not me. That's fine. Not a shirt. That's We're going to get butter in a minute. <laughs> His arms don't do it. Oh, there one. Oh, his arms have to go up. Gee. Oh. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> <laughs> Melvin's team is finished. They're going to a masquerade party. <laughs> what does that look? Yes. Absolutely extraordinary. Extraordinary. Dan, would you come up for a minute, please? He won. He won. He won. He won. Dan, would you give us a professional opinion? Who really won this contest? Who's going to stop traffic on 57th Street? Well, I think yes. as window dressers, they're very good entertainers. <laughs> <laughs> so who wins? I do. We do. Their imagination, neatness. <laughs> this win for imagination, this win for neatness. Nobody gets a prize. Thank you very much for being with us, Dan. We'll be back with What's My Line in just a minute. <laughs>